I'll do nicely. It's a soft. I've learned is that dignity comes from inside. Nobody can take away dignity from you if you don't allow them to do so. And those in the Scottish establishment who attempted to humiliate and degrade me only succeeded in humiliating themselves. Yay! And sadly in, in digging shame upon Scotland internationally. I, um, it's fairly horrible in there. You know, prison is not a pleasant place at all and Scotland should be ashamed of its uh, antiquated old-fashioned and retrograde justice system and the fact that Scotland has the highest prison population per capita in all of Western Europe. And I'm going to say a little bit more about that in a few minutes. But first, I want to thank everyone for their support. I should say that having uh, my wonderful family, my wife, Adela, <laughs> my children, Jamie, Emily, Cameron, little Oscar, who's not here at the moment, my grandson, Ossian, having the support of my family was amazing. And having the support of you wonderful people kept me going through it. And I should say that more than 2,000 people wrote to me in jail to say they didn't think I should be there. More than 2,000 people. Excellent. And I might add that although I today am delighted to be free, I shall never really feel free until my friend, colleague, Gillian Assange, is also there. Yeah. Yeah. And of course, until as a nation, Scotland itself is free from domination yeah. by an alien political culture. We have to fight this judgment that put me in. I am out and I am free. But we still have now, from a higher court, written into the law of Scotland, the whole of the United Kingdom, and able to be quoted in Commonwealth courts all around the world, a judgment that says that bloggers and mainstream media should be judged by different standards. A judgment that said that a blogger can be jailed for publishing the exact same thing the mainstream media publishers for which they should not be jailed. A judgment which says that new media can be jailed where mainstream media would be fine. Yeah. That is appalling. Yeah. Yeah. Unfortunately, our legal fight is just starting. We have to 
take this further. Yes. And this yeah. is going to end up at the European Court of Human Rights. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah.